Pearl village nestled on the outskirts of a bustling city, resided a brother named Asif and his sister Nalum. Their once happy childhood was marred by the cruel hand of fate, their father's demise echoing through their formative years. As time marched forward, Nalum blossomed into adulthood at 18, with Asif following suit at 20. Yet, destiny's bitter design struck once more, snatching their mother away from their lives. Asif, determined and resilient, shouldered the weight of their world. He ventured into the heart of the city to secure their livelihoods, becoming a pillar of strength for both himself and Nalum. The city's bustling energy contrasted with their village's tranquility, casting a bittersweet shadow on their existence. The siblings' bond grew stronger as they navigated life's tumultuous journey together. In the face of adversity, they clung to each other, finding solace in their shared memories and dreams. Asif's commitment to his role as both brother and provider shaped their story, while Neelam's quiet resilience added depth to their narrative. Their village home stood as a sanctuary of love and loss, a testament to their unbreakable spirit amidst life's unpredictable tides. Neelam's youth and beauty were undeniable, but Asif remained oblivious to the lurking danger of leaving her alone at home. Each day, he returned to a facade of normalcy. Unbeknownst to them, an ominous presence was creeping into their lives, drawn by Neelam's allure. Asif's closest companion, Bilal, found himself captivated by Neelam's radiant charm. The siblings inhabited a quaint village on the outskirts of a town, their humble abode standing in the shadow of a nearby graveyard. This eerie proximity to the resting place of souls cast a haunting spell over their existence. One fateful night, duty held Asif captive at work until the late hours. While circumstance is led by Lil to wander near the graveyard, a place shrouded in mystery and whispered tales. There, he encountered a chilling sight. Intrigued by the unsettling sight, Bilal's curiosity overpowered his initial trepidation, compelling him to approach the young lady by the grave. Twice he queried her, Who are you? Yet, her silence prevailed, adding to the air of mystery surrounding her presence. Unwilling to be deterred, Bilal persisted with his inquiries, and as the woman slowly turned, a disquieting transformation seized her features. Her once serene countenance now distorted into a furious visage, marked by bared, blood-streaked teeth and disheveled, coarse hair. The sight was jarring and horrific, further accentuated by the realization that the apparition before him was none other than Neelam. His heart pounding, fear took hold of Bilal's senses, and an instinctive urge for self-preservation surged within him. Terror compelling his actions, Bilal turned on his heels, sprinting away from the unearthly figure that was once his friend's sister. Behind him, the sound of frenzied pursuit echoed as Neelam gave chase, her elongated nails finding purchase on his skin, leaving a trail of scratches and anguish in her wake. Despite the searing pain, Bilal's determination to escape propelled him forward. Desperation guided his steps, leading him to salvation. A nearby mosque, its minarets reaching skyward, stood as a sanctuary against the otherworldly threat. Bilal's eyes fixed upon its welcoming presence, his feet carrying him swiftly to its entrance. He burst through the doors, his breath ragged, his heart racing, and his wounds a stark reminder of the night's harrowing encounter. Within the mosque's sacred confines, the atmosphere shifted from one of fear to one of refuge. The solemn serenity within the hallowed walls offered a respite from the nightmarish pursuit that had consumed him just moments before. As the echoes of the chase faded, Bilal took solace in the sanctuary he had found. Unaware that the events of this night would weave his destiny tightly with that of his friend Asif and the enigmatic Neelam. The pursuit through the night came to an abrupt halt as Neelam ceased her chase, 
leaving Bilal gasping for breath and relief flooding his senses. With the dawn's light, he recounted the eerie encounter to Bilal, hoping for her understanding and support. However, his words were met with skepticism from his friend, who, viewing the Ilum as a beloved sister, dismissed the unsettling account as mere jealousy. Undeterred by Bilal's disbelief, he lifted his shirt, revealing the scratches and wounds that bore witness to his harrowing escape. Yet, even this tangible evidence failed to sway Bilal's conviction, as he clung to his allegiance to Neelam. Determined to seek a solution, Asif recounted his experience to a sheikh he had encountered in the mosque. Moved by Asif's tale, the sheikh bestowed upon him a protective locket, instructing that it be placed around Neelam's neck. Should her malevolent transformation recur, he explained, cutting her hair and teeth would revert her to her true self. Armed with this potential remedy, Asif implored Bilal to consider the gravity of the situation. He stressed that it was a matter not just of Neelam's well-being, but also the safety of those around her. However, Bilal's devotion to his sister and disbelief in her transformation made him resist the suggestion. The bonds of sibling love ran deep, and Bilal's fierce protectiveness over Neelam overshadowed his ability to fathom the supernatural forces at play. Fear for his sister's well-being coupled with an unwavering belief in her inherent goodness kept Bilal's resolve resolute. The tale of intrigue, fear, and protective loyalty was poised at a crossroads, with the threads of fate and familial bonds tightly intertwined. The choices made in the coming moments would ripple through their lives, shaping the destiny of Asif, Neelam, and Bilal in ways they could scarcely imagine. Asif's concern for both Neelam's well-being and the potential dangers that loomed ahead drove him to insist on their course of action. He emphasized his dual care for them, acknowledging the possible threats that could arise from Neelam's transformation. In response, Bilal agreed to the experiment, suggesting they let the results speak for themselves once the locket was applied. Preparations were set in motion, and the night in question arrived. Bilal, resolute in his mission, took on the task Asif had laid out for him. Asif joined Bilal at his house, a hidden butcher's knife clutched discreetly in his grip. The tense atmosphere was thick with anticipation as they embarked on their bold endeavor. In a fraught moment, Asif approached Neelam with the locket, urging her to wear it as an act of precaution. To their astonishment, Neelam's initial reluctance unfolded into a startling revelation, she was petrified by the sight of the locket. A pang of suspicion gripped Asif as he observed Neelam's fear. The situation escalated when Bilal, his patience fraying, demanded that Neelam put on the locket with vehement insistence. Suddenly, the transformation that Asif had feared unfolded before their eyes. Neelam's demeanor shifted, and she lunged at Asif with malicious intent. The realization hit them like a thunderbolt, the locket's power could indeed hold an answer but its application had unforeseen consequences. In a swift act of desperation, Bilal brandished his knife and took drastic measures. Neelam's hair and teeth were severed, and in the wake of this grim intervention, the darkness that had consumed her faded, leaving behind the sister they had known. The aftermath of the ordeal bore heavy consequences. The events weighed heavily on Asif's mind, leading him down a path of unstable mental health. Seeking solace and healing, he turned to rehabilitation. Meanwhile, Bilal's unwavering loyalty manifested in a different way, as he embarked on a new chapter by marrying Asif's sister. Their lives were forever altered by the shadows of that fateful night, showcasing the depths of familial bonds, the complexity of human nature and the far-reaching impact of the supernatural.